Okay. Hello guys, welcome back to JBJ MTB. I'm Jules. Um, today we're out at Gap Creek Reserve. Um, there's a low side and a high side. We're just gonna focus today on the low side, the green and blue trails. I've ridden right to the very top of the first trail I'm gonna ride, it's Rocket Frog. It's a green trail the whole way down. You can basically stay, keep going on that road and keep going further up and you can get all the black black trails like Pipeline, Death Adder. Um, but yeah, we'll, we'll leave that for another day. Um, got me drop and send, rocking good. Um, the climb up here was, uh, I was, yeah, I was a bit apprehensive about it. it uh, yeah, it was a pain in the ass last time I came up here. I don't know whether it got easier because I can climb better or the oval chain ring I've got on now is working better or I'm fitter. No, I'm not fitter. I think maybe, or it might not be as bad as what I first thought. That's, that's more than likely the answer. But anyway, so yeah, we'll just take you on a little tour around Gap Creek. I haven't been here in ages, so um, we'll see how we go. And yeah, I think I'm just gonna do Rocket Frog, come back up and we'll do I think it's Lorikeet and Dingo and Bandicoot or something like that. The blue trails are a bit rockier, but this blue one, first one's a, just a flow trail and it's, can't believe it's green. It's really good fun. So anyway, let's drop the drums. I don't usually go here, I just go in from the fire road, but for all intensive purposes, we'll go from the top. Rocket frog. Let's go. I haven't done it for ages, so. This is a green trail. Absolutely blows Southside green trails out of the water. But there's no, there's lots of bee lines that you can go around. Once again, you can make it whatever you want. Here's a fire road. This is a fire road to come up. So then we drop back in. We can access the point there. Oh, I saw someone hit that one day. Not a chance. Oh, someone's made that. That's good. Look at that. Freaking green trail. That's just the top section. That's unreal fun. So here we come to a intersection. You go up there, you traverse around the mountain to go over to the blue ones. We'll do that later. But now we just stay on. Yeah, so that's Lorikeet. We'll go up there later we'll come back up but we'll finish off rocket frog that first starts bloody mental i think here down here it gets a bit more pedally but yeah green is basically beginners but i suppose it doesn't really matter what speed you come down you can come down as fast as you want or as slow as you want but there's no crazy obstacles that you are unavoidable. That's new. Plus it doesn't really go real well in wet because it's so... Look at the berms! Look 
No sweat trials. Sorry, good. Also a good little warm up if you want to go. Yo, I don't think that was there either. Staying out, it's been it's been a minute. A long minute since I've been here. But yeah. So good. As I was saying, the climb up wasn't as brutal as I last remembered either. Also got a, a wind sock with a GoPro, so I'll be interested if that cuts out any wind noises. Even though I like the trail sound and oh, the deep breathing's not awesome, but you just have to cop that because I'm 40. I'm <laughs> just having a crack. So I ain't no hell. Oh, fitness freak. I do ride for the fun and the fitness, so... It's a bit of a pedally bit, but... There's the scenery. Hard out rainforest. In here it's real... Boggy in the wet. It's running sweet today. We just had a big rainfall. Would have been good just to come straight after that. Get a bit sticky. But still good. Yo, oh, that's, that's new. I don't remember that being there. That was a big fuck off tree, it'd have to be there, but I don't remember it. Let's go high. Oh, let's go high here. Drop here. I forgot about that. Oh, sounds it nice. So just keep following the rocket frog signs. Sandstone kicker up here, which is real fun. If you hit it properly, and here's that water bath. Oh, no, I missed it. Knocked the top off that. So, just made the ride back up the fire road, which as I mentioned at the top, it, again, it was it was a lot easier. So, the oval chain ring is definitely helping, but not a, not that much. Because, um, oh yeah, I definitely, I was dreading going up it, but I think I might come down to 
Um, good old fashioned progress. Yeah, progress is, I'm 40 at the end of the day, so I can't be pushing myself too hard, but if I can ride up a fire road quicker than I did and feel better than I did the previous time, back in progress, so. Anyway, I've come up the fire road. I've come up this other cross link, which is L Lorikeet Link. Um, and it used to be brutal as well. I fucking hated riding up it, but it was, it was sweet as well. So I think we're all good. Okay, so here we go. I'm gonna go down Dingo. Come down here and this should fork. Oh, drop a few gears, I'm in climbing gears. Seats dropped. Let's see what we got here. Once again, it's been so long. I always hated climbing up here, so I never came. Oh, pretty rocky. So yeah, here's the fork. So the right, right way is bingo. And this is supposed to be flowy. It's going to bring us down to the bottom of Rocket's Rock. Yeah, oh, look at that. Oh, I was watching that drop. I wouldn't do that. I nearly died then, huh? Nice good drop there. Oh, high line was a terrible line. Terrible line. Very rudy, this is crazy in the wet. I've got a feeling this isn't the flow section. I think that's more chunky than isn't it? Drop that, land right into a gutter. Land right into a rut. That doesn't look awesome. I don't know if she was lost or really keen. Back on Rocket Frog, that's Dingo. Okay. So, yeah, there we have it, just two little tracks. Gap Creek, I'll come back another time and do Wallaby and Larrakeet go further all around, but yeah, we don't want to make this too long. Uh, before we go, if you come here, here's the car park and the picnic area. You park over here. But there's a fire, that's where the fire trail is. Straight up. And it's brutal. But to get around that one, there's a climb called Kariba Climb, which is just um, switchbacks. And it'll get you up over this one off. I've currently seen two XE guys just doing laps up and down the fire trail. Like, 
two tomorrow. I'm going up there. They've gone up, come back down, and they beat me back up there. They're beasts. But um, whatever floats your boat, I suppose. That, that ain't my gig. Um, so yeah, on that bombshell, we'll... Cool, that'll be the end of the video. And a massive shout out to Drop and Send. Go and visit them. Drop and Send clothing. I'll leave the link in the description. Got the old, old school OG logo. Same as on my bike. T-shirt. Use the promo code Duels08. And I'll see you on the next one. Um, peace out. Cheers, heaps, guys. Thanks. Bye.